Were you aware of, of the enormity of what was happening to you? I mean, obviously it was physically going on, in you, but were you aware of, of the, all the medical talk in chat, Megan? No, not really. Like, I knew that I had scoliosis, but I didn't know, like, the side effects on how much I was going to be in pain and how much I wasn't going to, like, do anything as a normal teenager. And as the 18 months were going on, did you feel frustrated? Did you feel, why, aren't, why haven't I been fixed? Or what was going through your mind? Yeah, it's only been in the past, like, six months that I've said, why haven't I had my surgery yet? Like, why are you leaving me get this bad? I'm in pain every single day. Just why can't you give me my surgery? And I just want to get a handle on, on your day-to-day -day in those 18 months. Was school an option? Or how, how, what was the level of discomfiture you were experiencing? It's only really been since December that I haven't gone to school. But um, I was, like going in for one day and then having to ring my mom to come collect me, then missing a day or missing a week, then go back in. So it was kind of just all over the place. And the reason you were missing school was just pure pain or discomfort or what was the, the... A little bit of both, to be honest. My rib was excruciating pain and I was just discomfortable sitting in a chair going around in my school bag because I have to move classes every 40 minutes. Yeah, OK. Now...